start off on our little mini trademark moon, thumbs up trademark thumbs up mini moon adventure um, but first we're on our way to a hotel called the North Coast or I think it's just North Coast Nova we always put a the in front because Scouse but it's North Coast in uh, Lanco I think it's called in Lancashire but on our way we're gonna stop at St Helens to see my friend Becky because she has opened a bar I don't even know how long ago it was now but it's a good while ago not a year but say like six months maybe maybe six months um, and I totally missed the launch for whatever reason I can't remember why now something to do with the baby probably so I just sent her a prezi and I feel terrible because I haven't been and I'm dying to go so this week she's actually opened it as a coffee shop in the day as well so half eight till half five Monday to Friday and I think nine o'clock on Saturday till half five um, it sells coffee and cakes and then in the night I think Thursday to Sunday it's a bar and it's gorgeous it's called the secret garden and I'm really excited to go so she doesn't know that we're coming this morning we've just decided that we're gonna surprise her the aim was to get there for half ten try and avoid lunch rush but of course we're always late so it's actually what time is it now well it's now 11 so we're not that late um, but we're still about 10 minutes away so very excited to see her and i can't wait to show you the bar because i've seen it on instagram and stuff and it looks gorgeous it's like um, a little mini bar and it's called the secret garden because part of it is open air um, i'm not sure how it works but i know it's heated and it looks really pretty so i'll show you when we get there we're here, we're at the secret garden. Yeah. There we go, we're drinking it. Oh, token thumbs up from Pete, as per. Um, we just arrived and I just bumped into Beck just as she was going for lunch, so I've ruined her day, sorry. I'm not gonna put her on camera because that's a bit cheeky, but <laughs> we're loving it. I've got me hot chocolate and I forgot to film it, so it's gone now, it's too delicious. But, um. It is on Instagram if you want to go over to Instagram and have a look. Um, I'm putting up pictures over there. And um, I made a mistake before. It's not open Sundays. Tell me the opening hours, Beck. It's Monday to Friday, 8.30 till 5. five. Saturday 9 till 5. Saturday 9 till 5, and that's the coffee shop part. And then the bar is open. 6 till 1.30. 6 till 1.30, Friday, Saturday. Mm -hmm. There we go. You heard it here first. And it's so cool. There's like little canopies of... But um, they also open in the sunshine. And yeah, it's just a cool little spot. Pete's working. Attempting to work over here. Yeah, what well. do you think, Pete? So good. So good. Leave me here. <laughs> I might too. I might too. Just leave you here. So I'll check in again with you later, guys. As I say, I'll be putting loads of pics up on my Instagram. So we had a great time over at the Secret Garden gym bar and coffee shop. And now we're on our way to our hotel. And um, we've booked North Coast in Lanco and we have the Master Garden Suite. And I'm so excited. So we've got that. Actually, I need to book the spa for tomorrow. I still haven't booked the spa. I've been in talks. Uh, they don't actually have a spa on site. So we're going to one locally. And um, I've just been discussing with them what we want to book, but I haven't actually booked it yet. So I'll get on the phone to them now. And um, I'll show you the room when we arrive. Right, guys, we've arrived, and I'm so excited to show you our suite. We've just come in through, and as you walk through to your left, is a little bathroom there because, of course, we need two bathrooms for the two of us. And then you walk through into this gorgeous, massive lounge. <laughs> our own couch bookshelf this is honestly this is bigger than Pete's flat when I met him <laughs> TV fireplace that'll be on later desk and then you come over here it's a bit bright but I'll show you this properly later outside this is our view on the terrace oh who is this I see <laughs> Pete Pratt how gorgeous is that guys a massive terrace so you come through here, there's our wardrobe, huge wardrobe, and here is the bedroom. How 
huge is that bed, guys. Could probably fit my whole family in there. Oh, wow. I feel a bit guilty that it's just Pete and I here. But it's absolutely amazing. Another desk. We've actually both brought our laptops, so that'll be really handy. Then through here is the bathroom. How amazing is this bathroom, guys? It's absolutely huge. I'm not sure if you can tell on the um, video, but it's absolutely huge. Hi! Two big mirrors, double shower, massive mirror, double sinks. I'm sorry, but I'm not going home. We're here for two days. We've got all our temple spa stuff here which of course I'll be taking me back with me. Wow, it's so sunny today guys as well. Look at that view. And there's the main building over there. People sat out in front of the restaurant. How are you enjoying your terrace, Pete? Oh dear. Oh dear, man up moving. Done. We should cancel the spa tomorrow. I'm happy just sat here all day. This is enough. Bucket of Coronas. Oh, get Got me a bottle available. of Prosec. Nice bottle of Prosec. There's half a bottle of champagne in the mini bar. Is there? Yeah. That's not for sure. <laughs> I doubt it. You can check the menu. <laughs> nice views as well, isn't it? Amazing. I think we've done well, yeah. So we're just getting ready for our meal tonight. Pete's just in his robe. Lord of the manor. <laughs> I'm in my robe too. Um, but Pete's just sitting here flicking through the channels and they actually have a live feed to the kitchen. Six till ten. You can see what they're doing in the kitchen. How crazy is that? Live episode of Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> How cool is that? We might actually see them preparing our meals. How cool is the kitchen anyway? Yes, I am editing while I'm drinking my Prosecco. So a daily vlog is going up tonight, but it doesn't really feel like work in this setting, does it? Nope. So we are now outside, we're down, we're ready for our meal, there's Mr. Pratt. <laughs> and uh, we're sat in the terrace just perusing the menu, which looks delicious. Um, and I specifically asked for no lamb. I know I'm weird, but I don't like lamb. And they've actually changed the menu for me to venison. Can't wait. These have arrived. We've got some kind of crab meat one. And this one is pig's, pig's head, did you pig's say? Pig's head, yeah. Local delicacy. But these are always delicious. Always, always. This is the infused Isle of Wight tomatoes with organic lovage and some kind of cheese. They were cheese cigars. This is the Gusnog Chicken Caesar, which was my least favourite meal of the night, but it was still amazing. So take from that what you will. Then we had the Moroccan Ascroft Cauliflower. Now this actually was my second favourite dish of the night. I mean, it's hard to choose because they were so good. But I was just so shocked by cauliflower. They got so much flavour in it. The spices were amazing. And this is the scarlet prawn, my favourite by far. The prawns were so buttery and good. This was my venison. You can see just by looking at that how good it was. And that's Pete's lamb. He went for lamb. And this was a strawberry trifle, but it just looked so good that I completely forgot to film it before we ate it. Cleared the plate. And that was the end of the night guys. I had a nice relaxing bath before bed and then you'll see the rest of what we got up to tomorrow. Bye.